In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace the front sway bar links on this 3 Series BMW. Let's get into it. We're going to remove the wheel, use a 17 millimeter socket, take the lug nuts off, or lug bolts. And when you get to the last one, I'm just going to hold the wheel on so it doesn't fall. Ah. Grab the wheel and slide it off. We're going to remove this nut right here. I'm going to use a 16 millimeter socket. Loosen that up. If the stud is spinning, what you can do is use a 16 millimeter wrench. Try to get on there. I'm gonna have to turn the wheel a little bit. I'm using a T30 socket. Just twist the stud in, take the nut off. And that slides out. Down below, we're going to loosen up the nut. Use a 16 millimeter wrench. And again, the stud is going to spin, so we're just going to hold that on there. Using a T30 socket. As you tighten the stud, the nut will come off. Slide that off and slide the link down. Take the new link, slide it up. Put the nut on. And I'm gonna use a five millimeter hex socket to prevent the stud from spinning. Tighten the nut down. Tighten that down. And we'll torque this nut to 42 foot pounds. And slide the top part of the link through the bracket in the strut. Get the nut. That started. I'm going to take a ratchet wrench and I'll use a hex key this time, just a five millimeter. You could use a socket or a, just a key. I'm going to torque this to 42 foot pounds. That's good. Put the wheel on, line that up. Take the lug stud or lug bolt, get that started. Put the other bolts in. Now we're going to torque the lug bolts to 90 foot-pounds in a cross pattern to tighten the wheel down evenly. Put 
Go around again, double check. It's good. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.